More than a month after a 12 year old boy was shot and killed in Red Lion, investigators arrested a 13 year old boy, charging him as an adult. Thanks for joining us for Fox 43 News first at four, excuse me, at five. I'm Marshall Keeley. Now the family is speaking out about those charges after weeks of tension in the community. Fox 43's Harry Lee is in Red Lion with the latest from the district attorney's office. Officials don't normally release the names of children involved in crimes, but anyone accused of murder in Pennsylvania faces adult charges. Now 13 year old Nolan Grove of Red Lion could face up to 40 years in prison. Oh, he's a great kid. I mean, oh, probably the best kid I ever met. Kevin Quickle's stepson, 12 year old Kane Highland, was killed on April 1st. Love being there for his brothers, his family. I don't know. I miss him to death. Today, 13 year old Nolan Grove was charged as an adult with third degree murder for allegedly shooting his friend in the back. Court documents say Highland, Grove, and another friend spent the afternoon together that day and planned to have a sleepover. At some point, Grove obtained a handgun from his house and was playing with it throughout the day. Around 8.22 that night, the friend told police, Grove said something about Highland's mother, and Highland told him to be quiet. He discharged a firearm into the back of Kane Highland, causing his death. Neither boy called 911, and Grove asked the friend not to tell anyone what happened, according to police. Decisions to charge anyone, let alone a 13-year-old with third-degree murder, are taken with the utmost seriousness and care. York County District Attorney Dave Sunday says though Grove was charged as an adult, the office wants to place him in a juvenile detention facility. The third degree murder charge carries up to 40 years in prison. Friends of the Highland family were pushing for a first degree murder charge, which requires intent to kill. It was plain as day. You went inside, grabbed the gun, came back out and shot him as you walked away. Simple as that. The family also wants Grove's parents to face charges for not storing their firearms properly. Got third degree murder charges thrown at him and licked his lips like nothing. His dad sat there, no sympathy on the kid or his father's face. To me, that's, that's not something that should happen. District Attorney Sunday says at this time, Grove's father is not being charged with a crime. This memorial was set up in early April as part of a candlelight vigil for Kane. His stepdad says he wants the community to remember him as the happy, strong 12-year-old that he was. In Red Lion, Harry Lee, Fox 43 News.